Hi, and welcome back to Deliver Us the Moon. So, here we are. We have our arse working, which is really good. Uh, we've got power up. So now we have a door that we can use with our arse. Oh, I see. Ah, that's neat. I didn't have to take control of it. Strange, that's off. Still no trace. This just doesn't feel right. Alex, scan for data history. Ah, there's a recording. Rolf, come in. I think I've got something. I found a recording from the 23rd. That's what, two days ago? Are you sure? Yeah. Can you see it from up there? I think so. Go ahead. Alex, project hologram from September 23rd, 2054. This isn't just the Moon Up crew. There's too many of them. These are Tombow evacuees. How do you know? These names weren't here before. There's still dust in the stone. On the monument, you mean? Yeah. Victims of the Tombow evacuation. The date is the day of the blackout. Something big must have happened over at Tombow. Pearson coming in for expedition team. Sarah, Rolf, anything on the state of the MPT? The entire network is down, and I've had no luck with bringing it back online so far. Make it quick. If things don't work out with the network, head back up here, whether the MPT is online or not. You have 20 minutes left to make it in time for evac. Copy that, Control. Rolf, I'll check out the living quarters and then head back to the elevator. Okay, so not... They obviously didn't make it in time. We have an upstairs. Tombra. Forgot that I had the flashlight. Vehicle bay sealed. Additional power required. No surprise. So this would be their reception. Yeah, because a uh, moon hub. MPT network. Let's have a look in this in a bit. Backup power. Backup power. Vehicle bay. So you need two for the vehicle bay. Crew quarters. Um, user Rolf Amazon access granted. Getting diagnostics, unable to connect to the network. And station power. Ooh. Not enough power. Yep, thought so. So I'm guessing that's, yep, power the vehicle bay. So that's where we've come from. So we're at the main base. Let's keep looking around. See if there's anything worth seeing. I'm in two thoughts at the moment. Whether or not the people here escaped on a ship, or if they um, went into cryo. Um, Mugen's memorial stone. In 2048, six years before the blackout, an experimental cryo sleep generator malfunctioned inside. Hugin's research facility. Only three people survive. Maria Grisella, Rosa Levert, and Edgar Davis for their bravery in the face of the disaster. 
they were awarded a symbolic coin, of which one seems to be missing. I think we found the other one. Yeah, because it is in someone's locker. Well, room. Rosella kept hers with her. Oh, sorry, Rose. I keep saying Rosella because of the name. My brain goes from Rose to the L part of her name. So we have crew quarters. You need one. What's upstairs anyway? Ooh, we have playback. Hold up. Do you see the people down there? They will be the start of a new chapter. Together, we will be humanity's future. At what cost, William? We're saving the species so we can start again. If this is what it takes for humanity to survive, I'll gladly take responsibility. There you are, Johansson. Without your help, this wouldn't have been possible. Isaac? This was not the agreement, you know that. We need to get the MPT back online. I'll be realistic, Rosa. Even if we ever manage to provide Earth with all the power it needs, what do we truly gain? More time to see oceans and deserts taking our homes. William, I've done my part. Let's just go. I'm done with this mess. You heard the man? Let's go. Outward begins. Well, they're not very happy people, are they? So, William MacArthur and Dr. Rosa debate over the moral implications of the actions. I'm guessing these doors are no good. Although they are. Another access to maintenance. Oh! We're back at the beginning. We can now go through these doors at the end, in the entrance. Let's unlock this one as well. Yeah, most definitely been here before. Thank you, Ars. Tombra, Reinhold, Outpost 1, Huggins. So we're over that side. Okay, there's a lot more to this than what I originally thought. Alright, let's get started somewhere. We need you. Let's do the crew quarters, have a look see in there. See what mess we get into in here. Ooh, that's not good. That is not good indeed. Stray chair. Thought WS protocol strictly forbids physical conflict on the moon. Carfa overloaded arse units, safely limiters for crowd control. Mainly express concerns over the dangerous voltage. It's 
bit of an extreme way of doing things. But, I'm guessing, it means we can get in here. Right, so we have that. How do we get our human in? Um, let's go this way. No? Okay, we don't go that way. Yes, how do we get our human in? Hmm. I'm guessing it's not going to be as straightforward as... Yep. There it is. Come in, Rolf. I'm at the quarters. Do you read me? Copy that, Sarah. I hear you. Anything interesting? Everything's deserted, so nothing new here. Sarah, Rolf, this is Pearson Control. Our time's running out. Take the elevator back up here to make it in time for evacuation. You've got two minutes. Negative, Control. MPT network is still offline. Leave it. We have to go. Head to the elevator now. I'm not putting anyone in risk. Understood. We're wrapping up now. Sarah, you heard Control. Are you almost here? Sarah, come in. Everything okay? Come in. Rolf, get over here quickly. An AZ unit just activated, but something's not right. The doors are locked behind me. What do you mean? We've got to go. I'm serious, Rolf. Get Exit over here. I can't get out. 30 seconds or you're too late for evac. Get to the elevator Negative now. control. Engineer Baker requires immediate assistance. We need more time. Situation procedure cannot be delayed. Negative. I'm calling up the elevator now. Negative control. Control. No, guys. There's still time. I just need some help. Rolf, are you still there? <laughs> No! No! Well, that's not encouraging. Okay, so we need door codes. That won't open. Looks like there's four to a bunk. Uh, let's I don't know how much of a pain these people are going to be so we best use whatever we've got in available nope can't go through there Can go in here. Uh, Eubogenics use hub construction year to enter the office. Do not use. Welcome back, little buddy. Use Moon Labs construction year to enter the office. I think it's 2020. Hang on, we just came through here. Uh, 
of the mission. 32. The Tombra facility was evacuated under obscure parentheses around the same time as MPT went offline. Whatever transpired at Tombra, these quarters provided ample room for temporary shelter under MacArthur's watchful eye. 2032, 2032, they're all over the place in 2032. Make it safe. Um, yes, back this way. Because we can't do anything else with this or interact with anything all the time, we've got this in our arm. So let's take this back. Put it in one of the vehicle things, and then I want to come back and continue checking on downstairs. Ah, uh, so vehicle bay. So that's one of two. going. Let's see what we see, shall we? Anything down here? Ping pong table? Machines? I 
think there was a door over... Oh, yep, yeah, over here. Diary. So, so this is 14.9. We've received another formal request from Sarah Baker, the lead engineer working at Pearson Space Station. She keeps asking about cancelled shipments for the Orion Wing. I worry that she might suspect something. How should we proceed? Um, I don't know. It won't let me scroll down again. Yeah. Frustrating. We'll keep this all on standby just in case. But I think it's about time to get power to the vehicle bay. We got a little buddy with us. Yeah, we got a little buddy with us. Crew quarters offline. Vehicle bay online. And I think that's where I'm going to call it for this one.